This is an ultrasound examination of the renal veins to rule out uh, thrombosis. This first image is a pulse Doppler of the left renal vein and uh, it is being measured uh, as it courses between the SMA and aorta and uh, appears to have uh, nearly continuous flow which is consistent with normal venous flow in the renal vein. This is an image of uh, the renal vein again as it passes uh, between the SMA and uh, aorta and uh, it is narrowed. Uh, this may be due to scanning pressure. This is a uh, color Doppler with pulse Doppler of the left renal vein near its entry into the left kidney. We're now looking at the right renal vein and its uh, origin in the right kidney and uh, there is complete color fill in one portion of the image and some apparent dropout in another. This may be uh, the location of the vena cava. And that was the location of the vena cava. Here the renal vein is seen completely filling with color flow. Uh, it may meander slightly out of the imaging plane and that would account for the small gap. The venous flow is, is continuous which is normal. There is some uh, renal artery signal on this uh, uh, pulse Doppler tracing as well. The vena cava has a respiratory phasic signal which is normal for the vena cava. Again another look at the left renal vein. It's difficult to determine uh, caliper placement but uh, it appears to be continuous. There is some interference of the left renal vein on this image. Left renal vein again appears to be continuous. The stop and start of the venous flow is likely to be due to respiration and this would account for the renal artery appearing in the image. The renal vein at its origin appears to fill completely with color Doppler and uh, some branches of the renal vein can be seen uh, on this image. Another image showing complete filling of the renal vein with color Doppler. And this concludes the exam. There is uh, a limited but adequate examination of the renal veins and there is no evidence of renal vein thrombosis.